Alright All right, guys, what's happening? I uh, just wanted to uh, show you guys the progress on the 72 bow front. Um, just got done uh, painting the back black. I uh, did decide to go with the black background. Uh, super, super happy with the way it turned out. Um, thanks for all you guys' uh, comments, inputs, and suggestions on doing that. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with the way it turned out. I'm glad I did do this. I'm glad I went with the black background. Um, also, touched up the stand. Um, the stand, I actually repainted everything inside the stand so it came out really good. Um, there was a couple spots that were, uh, you know, just wear over time, and but I repainted everything. Uh, running my carbon down there now. Um, so this is the last stage uh, of the... Uh, cleaning of the tank, disinfecting, so I'll let it run like this with the carbon in it for two or three days. I'm not in any rush, so I'll just let it run, and I uh, just picked up another 20-pound bag of sand today at a uh, local fish store, so got two 20-pound bags plus two full five-gallon buckets full of sand, and then uh, the sand that'll come out of the 30-gallon nano that I got. Uh, so I'm figuring I probably have about 80 to 80 to 100 pounds of sand in there, which should give me a nice, really nice five 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 inch sand deep sand bed. I'm um, gonna probably try to bring it up to right underneath um, that bottom uh, overflow right there, um, the bottom part of that overflow system, where whatever that is. Um, try to bring it up to right there. Um, and then another thing I was thinking about doing is I've got um, some more of this flex tubing. You know, I'm not really sure what it's called. Um, whatever this whatever this flex tubing here is coming out for the return. I've got a whole bunch of that left. I've actually got um, a Y fitting that I'll put in there to split that um, just to try to get me uh, some you know d directional flow coming out of there. It'll probably probably decrease, uh, decrease the flow rate a little bit, but I'm not real worried about it. Um, in total, once time I get my tower heads and everything, it'll be about seven, it, well, it will be 1,725 gallons an hour turnover, which is right at 24 times an hour that uh, this tank will be turned over, which is uh, more than adequate enough uh, turnover and flow rate. So. Just wanted to do a quick update here, guys, let you guys see the progress on the 72 bow front. Um, if you guys got any comments, questions, concerns, uh, hit me up. Let me know what you guys think about the progress. Um, and, uh, stay tuned, guys. If you like my video, subscribe, 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 guys. I got tons more videos coming out on the 72. It'll probably be about, uh, probably be another week or so before I actually, um, start adding, uh, putting, you know, mixing the salt water and uh, adding the sand. Uh, one thing about that, guys, let me get all your feedback on uh, the best way and uh, any experience you guys have on doing that. I know when I did my 30-gallon, I put the sand in first, uh, then mixed the salt water as I added to it. Um, what I was thinking about doing uh, this time is uh, adding all the salt in first, then adding the water. Um, let the salt mixture mix in, mix in, uh, mix in good with the water um, for, you know, an hour or so, turn off all the pumps, then add all the sand, uh, make it really chummed up. Uh, it should start the good bacteria growth. Uh, but let me know uh, what you guys think about that. If there's a better way to do it, please feel free to hit me up, let me know. Um, but I'm thinking that would probably be a good way to do it um, instead of uh, putting the sand in first and mixing the water on top of that. Um, this way, uh, you know, as the sand's going in the tank, it's going to get wet right from the get-go instead of having to seep down uh, into the sand bed over time. Uh, but like I said, let me know, guys, what, you're, uh, what you think about this idea. If it's a good idea, if it's not a good idea, let me know a better way, please. Uh, feel free to comment, guys, and uh, stay tuned. Lots more videos to come. Thanks for watching. See you.